Hey guys, still here and welcome back to ICBM. In today's version of the gameplay that you're about to see, I'm teaming up with Gosrith, and we have set the alliances to be predetermined. We're going to have North America and South America working together, Europe and Russia, myself and Gosrith, and Africa and West Asia. Now, interestingly, when you set up these predefined teams, you can select do you want to build in each other's territory, but for some reason you do not share technology. So we're going to share technology in a bit of a different way. I'm going to go defensive. I'll build SAM sites and I'll build radar sites. And that's going to be the priority to defend both myself and Gosrith. So I'm going to be building a lot of SAM sites. Gosrith is probably going to go for an offensive strategy with either air bases or ICBMs. We haven't coordinated that yet. Um, and I'm going to take the opposite party so that we don't each have, let's say, 50% tech done. But he has going to have all the tech done for the air bases, for example, and I'm going to have all the tech done for ICBMs. And that way, both of our strikes are going to be more efficient. And at the same time, I'm going to be trying to defend all the territory because I'll have researched the SAMs and the radars. All right, here we go. You're going to be listening. Oh, actually, no, 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 no. Here we do not go. Um, I need to redistribute the points. I'm going to go a lot of tech advantages early on, saving me time. SAMs. ABMs, um, improve, no, not improved, Space Radar, because the Space Radar is the prelude to Over the Horizon Radar. That's proving to be a bit too expensive, but this is now required to make sure that your SAMs can actually hit those missiles or those ballistic missiles as they're coming in over the horizon. Um, improved Long Wave Radar is also going to help, and I can buy two SAM sites, and that'll be it. All right, you're going to be listening in on Gosrith and myself chatting about the game. Um, it is against the AI because the game is still not out yet. And um, we couldn't really find anybody else to play tonight. So here we go. All right, here goes. Let's do it. All right, once again. Uh, you mentioned your important cities. Dhaka, Beijing, Seoul, Tokyo, Hong Kong. I think that's the crux of it. My east coast. I have 50 SAM sites queued up. This is going to take 50 minutes <laughs> just to build that. And I'll back it up with um, over the horizon radar. Great. 12 minutes to my first air base is operational. Okay. 36 and go stealth. Aircraft. Yep. I have to specify with you on. Are SAM sites totally blind without radar? Mm, not totally. They have some radar coverage, but it's pretty limited. Mm -hmm. Their radar range, shortwave radar only, 250. Gotcha. So they're not utterly useless, but without an ABM site or an over the horizon radar, they're not that useful. Tokyo is such a huge on. target in this game. 21.5 million. Moscow, 10 million, 30% of their GDP. Oh. Like, that's Russia's issue, is that... Yeah. I mean, all the population is such a small area, it's... You can defend it well, mm -hmm. but if you have any slip up in that... Like, I think Russia and Europe have to always go hardcore on SAMs. Yeah. Because of that reason. I don't really know how otherwise you would defend Europe, because you have so many threats on your air on your uh, territorial waters that navy is tricky to use. I like putting a cruiser and a destroyer in the Black Sea and Caspian Sea. Yeah. Because then you can secure West Asia. Most Research complete. Yeah. Add an air base, and you can take out the remaining Indian bit, which I think for us here, my first air base can be trying to neutralize the Indian subcontinent. Something was shooting stuff off of Kuala Lumpur and Singapore. I think I had a naval skirmish inside of my waters and I couldn't even see it. <laughs> I'm getting AWACS now, so we'll have a better chance to watch. Now I'm scared to actually deploy SAM sites on my own territory because I'm worried they'll get shot at. 
That's something I hadn't considered when we devised this little strategy. <laughs> that someone would sneak around to you? Yeah. I will have to call on you to defend my bases. Yeah. Research I already complete. lost Awax. You lost it? So, in a way, you found the rare base, then? Yeah. You yeah, say West that. Asia's air base. I'm waiting for my second air base, then I'm gonna strike it. Yeah, my idea is if we take out West Asia's strike capability, that'll make both of us safer. Yeah, agreed. And then once they're neutralized, we can worry about things in the water or whatnot. Russia, Africa. Yeah. I know Just that the US America. cannot really get to us. They can uh, hit Auckland. That's the only thing that's they can, the can yeah. hit. That's what they can hit. Yeah. Yeah. I can't believe I lost Maywax so quickly. <laughs> Ooh, that's a lot more SAM sites than I thought. Research hmm. complete. They're productive then. Yeah. Alright, I'm getting somewhere in the defense of this territory, but this is a huge area that I need to cover with all these sounds. Yeah. There's just an air base somewhere in Siberia I'm trying to spot. There's a carrier group. Where? Um, north side. Oh, to the north. Russia's carrier group. Yeah. Those over the horizon sites take a long time to get going. Research complete. Looks like I'm going to be researching defensive stuff for the next hour. Uh, after that, I'll start working on the ICBMs. Great. Russia's so far, it seems like you're not down. actively getting attacked yet. No, I'm actually just struck, took out Russia's airbase um, north of Moscow. Right. Jeez, the next... range in these is huge. With this over the horizon radar next to your airbase. Uh, mm -hmm. The northern one. I can see all the way to London and Dublin. Nice. That's something else that would be handy to have, to see what sort of SAM sites, range, radar range your ally has. Yeah. would be very nice. Just I have an sure AWACS in your territory. Oh, yeah. Do you want me to you. search? Uh, maybe a little east of Auckland, see if they have a carrier group out there. Okay. Because then I know if I can deploy more assets over there on the east coast of mm -hmm. Australia. I'm bringing between New Zealand and Auckland first. Oh crap, you also need advanced long wave radar to make sure that those things work better. Well, Auckland is safe. Okay.
Perma spotting the West Asia Air Base now. Right. Yeah, I don't like how they have three of them. No. And a load of SAM sites. Mm -hmm. That's a threat. Good afternoon. Hello. You're in the middle of a recording, Sparky. My apologies. Alright, advanced have... SAMs in 12 minutes, and then ABMs in uh, 26. Right. Or in another 26, I'm afraid. I really wonder if this is the right strategy, because while we're doing this, they could be building clusters. Mervs. Yeah. Oh well, might as well give it a try. I think it's more effective than satellites, at least. There's the, char there's the Russian character. Yep. I'm just researching. I'll quickly yeah, throw up a radar in uh, Japan to see what's going on with those guys. I can spot them, but I can't shoot them. Yep. Yeah, they, oh, Jesus, they destroyed. already took out my uh, radar. I think an AWACS might be safer. Yeah. We need to take those guys out soon, or they're going to destroy that entire SAM network. Launching. Good luck, because it looks like those bombers are seriously neutered. Or those. Look at that! That took a lot of bombers to get rid of those. Yeah. Damn. Long run, I think it was worth it. Yeah. But, oof, it did hurt. How long is it going to take you to build, what, 10 bombers? 8 bombers? How many did you lose? Uh, let's see. Is that just Each 8 minutes? Four, 3. I lost 5 bombers. Okay. Each bomber takes me, build right now, 43 seconds. Okay, so you did come out on top, because if I want to build one aircraft carrier, that's 10 minutes. Yeah. And that's not to mention things that we can destroy. Yeah. Research complete. Alright, advanced ABM starting now, 26 minutes. I'm throwing up quite a few SAM sites around your airbases as well. We're going to need the hell out of those. Yeah. Russia Do you have cruise missiles left. yet? Um, I have cruise missiles. I'm working on hypersonic. Okay, cool. Because that's going to be very useful against those SAM sites. If you can get the air launch ballistics. Yep. Have another, Russia has another carrier somewhere up there. I'm another one? European. Yeah, north of Moscow again. Interesting. But Russia itself is undefended. They have one radar site in the entire territory. Right. So they can project power, but they're very blind. Correct. Okay. Alright, at this point, I have 42 operational SAM sites. Kong still needs a few. Do you have any more spots in your territory that you see as weak spots? I mean, I other than borders, but cities mostly. Not really. Oh, there's a big air battle now. Whoa. Do you want to slow I it just... down? It doesn't make a difference. I can't control them. Yeah. <laughs> are they using advanced fighters? I think so. Yeah, they are. They're the tier 2 fighters. I'm stealth fighters. Yeah. Yeah, they're tier 2. I could assist her with a SAM site or two. That'd be great. I'm not even sure if they really have the range to get into your territory. I don't think they really do. They've lost a few of these things already, so that's good. I mean, think how many minutes they just lost there of production. Yeah. 
Well, not their production. They, they lost their air sight or their their air force. I guess I count that as production. Yeah, fair enough. But I mean, they're not hindered in the way that they can produce new ones. Correct. Do you still have an AWACS we can send over Russia? Because I don't like not knowing anything about them. I have um, AWACS already over Russia. Oh, there it is, yeah. Because yeah, I'm Russia's not seeing air bases. I'm not seeing silos. What are they doing? I've hit them a couple of times. Okay. That would explain that. Preventive nature, you know? <laughs> Just doing some preventing and maintenance on Russia. Yeah. Okay. Aircraft launch ballistic, uh, ballistic missiles. That's going to be very handy. There was a boomer in the Pacific, but we hmm. lost it. So. Okay. I'm going to throw out a couple of destroyers. Yep. Especially since I already have quite a lot of updates to the uh, service capability. Mm -hmm. I just... I'm, st I'm using standard SAMs and standard ship ship missiles. Or service to service missiles. Great. Right. So that's a bit of a setback. It means I can see them before they see me, probably. But that's the extent of it. The only Last thing that's really advanced, advanced is my SAM. It's good network, though. What are the other guys going for? Europe is going for MRBMs. They have two air bases that we know of. North America, barely know anything. South America is working on ABMs. Huh, so we barely know anything. Yep. That's great. <laughs> Lack of satellites. Yeah. I don't really want to go satellites because it's going to take me forever to just catch up in the first place as far as offensive yeah. capabilities go. Researching MRBs. Okay. Or MRBM. <laughs> Full words, John. Yeah, I'm really also researching that. I still really would like to share research. Mm -hmm. It would also really help the AI. They need it. I mean, Supposedly, in this new patch, if they see that you and your alliance are sharing research, then they also try to do it. I saw that when I tried um, stuff earlier today. Oh, um, I need to strike Africa right now. Yeah? Oof. That's a lot of silos. Okay. Uh oh. I can't reach the other one in Cape, in Cape Town. All right. I'm hunting down a West Asian destroyer. I could hit it way before it could hit me, but it seemed like it just didn't really have any kind of upgrades. So they didn't push anything into their navy. Or their missiles. North American if not that, group. then what? That was terrible. What happened? All my bombers from one site um, launched against the carrier group from the Americas, north of Russia. Mm -hmm. And let's just say I don't have bombers that spy anymore. <laughs> the carrier is still alive. Yeah, I'm not sure what they did to carriers, but those things are scary. Definitely true.
Looks like those missile silos in South Africa are not too impressed with what you're doing to them. I took out one, and that's it. Finally working on building missile silos now. Nice. I hope that they're not going to declare war before two and a half or two forty-five. If they do, I'm in trouble. That'd be inconvenient. <laughs> Declaring war when we don't want it. Yeah. But that said, we've neutralized a lot of their stuff. Yeah. And supposedly, if you push the AI too much, they're going to go underground. Quite literally, they're going to go submarines. I've seen them do it. You keep destroying the surface assets, they start building boomers. Still, they'll be behind in tech. Yes. So. If they want to try and recoup what they had. You got a Russian destroyer coming in off the west of West Pacific. Oh, sorry, West Asia. Saw that launching at it. Oh, and there's a, another missile silo from Africa. I'd say when we do go to war, um, let's try and hit Russia, Africa, and West Asia. Yep. Skip Europe for a bit. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go cities. I don't think there's much infrastructure for me to target now. <laughs> mm -hmm. If you're using your bombers, don't forget to select uh, on the attack plan, select best config. So they'll automatically pick the best weapon system. I'm doing it manual because things are changing so much looking at three different groups. Mm -hmm. Oh, a new West Asian silo. Right off the border. Are bombs more effective or missiles, I wonder? I think missiles, but I'm not sure. Missile silo in West Asia. <laughs> Utterly unimpressed. What are those bunkers have, made of? I think they've improved that too. Yeah. They are a lot tougher than they were. I mean, that makes sense. But still, I don't like it. Yeah. I mean, they got buffed, but it's effectively a nerf against the destroyers and the, well, the submarines, like we saw in the previous test game. They put a missile silo next to Dekka. Dekka. Yeah, that's the one I've been shooting at for the last two minutes in game. Oh, there I we just go. just noticed. 20 B2s <laughs> took it out. That works. Um, let's see. Put up a side over there. I pro Do I need long-range radar or shortwave? Uh, long wave would improve the capabilities of your AWACS. Mm. Going for that destroyer off your coast. I have a destroyer off my coast? Yep. Oh, yeah. No idea. Um, it's a carrier group. Oh! I okay. no longer have. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Is it a carrier group though? Because I don't see a carrier. Uh, I think so. There's two destroyers. Let me get my AWACS. Oh yeah. Go. Yep. And a cruiser. <laughs> oh no. Um. Air Lawrence cruise that? missiles? No, they're nuclear tipped. Yeah. They might not take kindly to that. It'd be funny, but <laughs> probably be the end of us. Yeah. Hmm. So those are medium aircraft, I think. Tier twos. Yeah, I can win them in the air, but I just can't. Those are F-18s. Yeah, I can't beat the. 
can beat the ships. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really have too much to assist. I can try building a few ships and just drop them into the ocean altogether. Maybe that works. But a cruiser takes me five minutes. Yeah. It does look fairly threatening. Having those things off of my coast. Production complete. And a plan. I'm at five silos now. I just don't have any spare nukes yet. I'm going to have to go all the way through boosted fission weapons to get to heavy rockets. It's going to take me another 42 minutes. If I'm going to go MERVs, it's going to take me another 40 minutes as well. This is not good. Unless I boost my research. I'm doing a strike on the West Asian air bases. Mm -hmm. As I fly by a Russian SAM site. Yay. Oh, lovely. Ooh. That's painful. You sure you're not losing too many of those things? What things? I don't have things. Yeah, <laughs> things. Those things. Um... Ideas? <laughs> Don't do that. We need, missile. we need missiles. A missile will take care of that. I think the ships off of my coast are unupgraded. For now. Yeah. Um, I'm about to deploy a bunch of destroyers against them. I can launch my aircraft at the same time. Just let me know yeah. exactly when. I'm trying to drag out this auto deploy period as long as possible. Yeah. I got four of them ready now. I'm gonna tune it back to double speed now. Two speed yeah. instead of three. All right, I got five DDs, and they're going to be spawning into the Melbourne area. Let's see, are you ready for this? Yep, launching it now. I'll definitely win the air war. This many SAMs on destroyers will be fine. Cruise is gone. Air is gone. Good. Okay. I, I didn't lose anything, but I don't know about you. <laughs> Five. Oof. I don't think I need... I'm building one more airbase, and the rest is just replacing losses. Yeah. It's getting expensive. It's getting expensive, but I'd rather lose one of these mm -hmm. than lose anything else. Like, lose natural structure. I try and look at the exchange thing mainly in terms of how long it took me to build something versus the other person. Yeah. I don't think West Asia is going to have Production a good time here. Complete. They're too close to the alliance, and Europe's not been hit. Mm -hmm. North American Navy is fully up or is pretty upgraded at least. Where is the North American Navy? There's a destroyer off of Vancouver. Yeah, yeah, you can just kind of check its tech. It's got a good bunch of stuff. Yeah. That's, I think, advanced SAMs. Yeah. Yeah, that's the best SAMs and ABM. Torpedoes and... Uh, is that ASAT? No, that's ship to ship. Oh, sorry, surf, 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 surf missile. I'm going to go 100% tech for a while. Hopefully, yep. I'll still have 19 minutes left to get my heavy rockets. <laughs> it's a big if. If war's declared now, I have, what is it, five silos? 
Five silos and 12 missiles standing by. I will first... Hold on. Why am I not target West Asia? When I, if I were to exclude my strike plan now, they're going to go all out on Moscow. Four nukes, all Moscow, and one goes to Bombay. I mean... It's not necessarily a bad plan. Yeah. I'm just waiting to get my 50 megatons. Yeah. But I can't launch 50 megatons on a, an ICBM. You can launch MIRVs, though. Not if I don't research them. That's a fair point. Enemy SSBN destroyed? What, by me? Or in general? I think if you destroy the Pacific, it's if I had to guess, that one out there. How many cruise missiles do you have stored? Air uh, launched. I have, I have zero things stored. Oh, okay. I can... Careful, new SAM site over Kabul. Thank you. Get this guy to take care of that. Your launch ballistic missile, is that a nuke? Uh, I think so, yes. They do usually have a red marker on the map when you actually launch them. Yeah. I have ten of them now. Okay. They take, what, five seconds to produce, I think. Yeah, it's nothing. They're so fast. And it's fantastic to overwhelm those missile defenses. You could wipe out all the air bases in That's West Asia in one go. Yeah. Just don't do it yet, because that'll probably declare nuclear war. But it might be good to do it now, because nuclear war without those four air bases, all of their assets. Mm hmm. Boys. That we know of. Africa. Africa two has two silos missile silos. Together. Yeah. That's generous. Yeah. For some reason, though, those are not being targeted. Ah, there we go. Um, before this whole party gets started without our consent, what are you going to be targeting? What are your strike plans? Strike plans are West Asia, their mm -hmm. air bases, and then the other strike plan is cities for West Asia. Last trick plan is the missile silos for Africa. Research right. complete. If you can take care of the air bases in Africa, I'll take care of the silos in. Uh, oh, sorry, in West Asia, I'll take care of the silos in Africa. Sounds good. And any other that I can find. I have knowledge of three of them. But again, we don't know anything about Russia. Uh, Russia's. I've been flying over there regularly. I don't think they have anything. Okay. I am actually down. Oh, nuke started. Shit, nukes. Okay, slow down to one speed. Yep. Um. Yeah, I'm executing on Africa. Yep, I'm executing all my plans. Execute, or Africa is also executing. Here it goes. Yep. Nice taking those out quickly. That's one, two, three. I'm sending the AWACS a little further north. Yep. Nuclear threat detected on me. Oh. Submarine. Origin. Southwest. Yep. Oh, those are MIRVs. Oh, work it. Yeah, that's one silo down. Shit. Let me guess. Kind regards, Africa. Structure destroyed. Alright guys, with that cliffhanger I'm going to leave you, because this is going to be a hell of a long game. And we are going to be playing the long game as well, because this is going to be probably the longest game that I've played on ICBM so far. 
So, part two is coming tomorrow. You're gonna have to be a little patient and part two is gonna be well worth it. So tune in tomorrow, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll catch you tomorrow for part two.